Hello students, uh, we have taken a new topic, okay, it is the end term from the end of a finite AP. All of you know how to find the end term from the beginning, a n equal to a plus n minus 1 into d, where a is the first term, d is the common difference, this is known to all of you. Now, today we have taken a new topic, that is from the end, how can we find the a particular term, the n term here. Say an a p let us consider a next term is if the common difference is d next term is a plus d next term will be a plus twice d in this way. If we go on the n term b l a n or the last term is l. Now you see when we move from this side we are adding d continuously okay to get the next consecutive term. Now, from here you see, this is the third term. From the second term, how can we get if we know a and d? Just we should subtract d. a plus twice d minus d is a plus d. From second term to first term, how can we get? We have to subtract d. In this way, from left to right, if we go, we have to add d and from the end, if we come to the forward, then we have to subtract d. Similarly, here if the last term is L, what will be the its preceding term? It is L minus D. Okay, now today our aim is to find what is the N term from the end. So if we write the this particular AP in the reverse order, how can we write L? Okay, for now if we write in the reverse order, this will be the first term L, then the next term will be L minus D, next term will be L minus twice D will go on okay and the last term will be a how many terms are there n terms n terms are there now let us now what we'll do we'll apply this formula to find the particular n term we know a n equal to okay as you know let us change the symbol a plus n minus 1 into d okay now from this end, how can we find the n term? Here the first term is L. N term we have to find. What is the common difference? Common difference is the here. How can we find second term minus first term? So in the last I am showing how to find the common difference. L minus D, second term minus first term. Minus L. So common difference is now minus D. Let us change the symbol D. Capital D we have taken. It is minus d. Okay, so l plus minus minus n minus one into d. So you can use this formula whenever it is asked find the n term from the end. Okay, now let us do a sum. In the sum, I will use. We shall use this formula. Now, if we forget this formula and if we know this formula, then also using this. Using this concept, we can do the sum. Let us see how. All right, student. We wrote a question. Find the twelfth term from the end of the AP minus two minus four minus six dot 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 minus hundred. Okay. And if we want to use the formula, how will write? Okay. Here, L is equal to minus hundred. D equal to minus four minus of minus two. This is minus 4 plus 2 is equal to minus 2 n equal to 12 just we have written the given so that we can do easily now we know what is the formula known to us a n the, from the end the n term from the end l minus n minus 1 into d this is the formula l is how much minus 100 minus n is 12 minus 1 d is how much this is minus 2 okay minus 100 minus this is 11 into minus 2 so minus 100 plus 22 it is minus 78 so 12 term from the end of the ap from the end of this particular ap is minus 78 now by chance if you forget this formula then how can you find let me show that also so in that case what you will do, you will, what is the question, 12, the, find the 12 term from the end, 
then let us reverse the AP. So in that case, our solution starts from here. Let us write the AP in the reverse order. Minus 100, dot, 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 minus 6, minus 4, minus 2. Okay, students. Now here, if when you have written the AP in the reverse order, what is the first term? Minus 100, you can see the common difference. Suppose this minus this, okay? Then uh, either, uh, either minus 2 min uh, minus 2 or minus of minus 4 or this term minus this term. The common difference is always same as you know. Minus 2 minus of minus 4. It is minus 2 plus 4 is equal to plus 2. Have you understood students? Okay, let us proceed. N is equal to how much? 12. We know. Let us use the usual formula. A n equal to A plus n minus 1 into D. In, in our case, A is minus 100, n is 12 minus 1, the value of D is 2. This is minus 100, 11 into 2, minus 100 plus 22. It is minus 78. So, 12 term from the end of this particular AP is minus 70. You can check the answer. In both the case, the answer is same. Okay, students. So it, your, it will be your choice by which method you will do. Okay, students. Thank you.